The Irish Catholic Catechism for Adults is a sure and authentic presentation of the doctrine of the Catholic Church, and it is for adults. This text is actually an adaptation of the United States Catholic Catechism for Adults. The Irish Bishops' Conference asked for permission to adapt their catechism for use in Ireland. And in 2008, uh, the President of the United States Conference of Catholic Bishops, he gave permission for the North American Catechism to be adapted for use in Ireland. And so from that date, that is from 2008, up until the year 2013, a group worked on the adaptation. It was then sent to the uh, Irish Episcopal Conference for approval. The conference approved it with a few minor adjustments. And then finally, uh, that edition was sent off to Rome and Rome approved the Irish Catechism at the beginning of the year 2014. It's not surprising that when the Irish Catholic Conference of Bishops decided to adapt some sort of a catechism, that they looked uh, across the Atlantic to North America. Because if you cast your mind back to the year 1875, there was a synod held here in Maynooth in Ireland. And one of the fruits of that synod was uh, the bishops decided at the time to produce a national catechism for Ireland, which was to be called the Maynooth Catechism. In people's minds, people call it the Green catechism because it had a green cover on it and uh, printed by Gills of Dublin. Now, as it turned out, that catechism was not widely accepted. That Maynooth catechism was not widely accepted in Ireland. But strange to say, when it went abroad, other churches uh, looked at it and 42% of the questions and answers from the Irish Green Catechism made their way into the North American Catechism called the Baltimore Catechism. And actually, believe it or not, 100% of the questions from the Irish Green Catechism made their way into an Australian Catechism. So the Australian Catechism of the time was a complete copy of the Maynooth Catechism. So it wasn't surprising that when in 2008 the Irish Episcopal Conference were wondering where they might get assistance to produce a catechism that they would look to North America because there had been that history there. And the North American Conference in 2008, as I stated previously, was the first conference to produce a catechism in the English language that was based on the universal catechism of the Catholic Church.